Good morning, good morning, and welcome back to another vlog. As you guys saw, um, I woke up extremely early this morning to knock out my run. We got two miles in, um, and now we just pulled into the airport. Woo! So Sydney and I were going to Michigan. We were actually going to tour venues for our wedding. Um, so yeah, bring you guys along bring you guys along so we're gonna go ahead head into the airport I'm gonna look for some grub um, I think we're going to check out the Delta lounge for the first time ever for both of us so we're excited but let's do this let's get to Michigan and let's, let's, get, a, let's get a wedding venue let's get a wedding venue peace <laughs> What's up, y'all? We are here in Michigan. Um, we're actually sitting at the venue. It was kind of a scare getting here. Our rental car is a Tesla. My first time ever driving one. And I got in it, we get down the road and I realized that we had like 20% battery. So we're like 30 minutes away from the venue, trying to figure out how to get to a charger to charge this darn thing. Um, ended up getting to one and um we made it and we saw the venue but i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna show you guys a little bit of what it's looking like as well so we don't know if this is the one we're looking at a couple others while we're here but i mean it's pretty it's pretty beautiful it's very unique it's like a greenhouse um type of venue so it's unique it's beautiful uh, we both like it a lot. I personally wish that it was on a bigger piece of land. I don't know why I'm looking for a venue that's sitting on like an acre of land. I just feel like that's like my dream wedding, but I understand we can't always get everything we want and it's about making Sid happy and what she likes. Um, what, we like. what we like, but ultimately my goal is what you like. You wanna say hi? Vlog. Oh my gosh, this place is freaking stunning. It is really nice. And I'm just gonna give you guys kind of a brief look of the outside. So it's all glass. All glass, the roof is glass. They have these shades in here that slide over. So at night, you can literally see the stars. So, as I said, it's very unique, uh, but it's very beautiful we actually both really like it it's completely different than what we envision our wedding to be but hey sometimes that happens so like i said we're looking at a few other ones while we're here uh, but now i think we're gonna go ahead and get some food and get settled in so check in with you guys in a little bit so we are frequent flyers of the church. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to word this. I think we'll just start out by saying that we have spent more time looking and being at these charging stations today than we've done anything else. Um, Is that normal for like Tesla people? Like are y'all doing this all the time? So I think it's a good car if you're staying within your city and your town and just everyday living but as far as traveling so right now we are trucking three hours across Michigan so with that being said and then I think previously we had to drive like an hour and a half almost two hours so just traveling a total of five hours I I mean the battery it's like getting gas mm -hmm. essentially but um I don't know, it's very, it's, it's frustrating because, you know, we've been traveling all day, a lot of driving. We are heading to our hotel and we just, we're very tired and we just want to get there, but we're on our way. We're almost there. Um, so I updated you guys with the venue. We saw that. And then after that, we went and had a little lunch with grandma, mm -hmm. which was so, so good because 
she lives here in Michigan, obviously, and she's very familiar with our, with the area of our um, venue tomorrow. And she said that area is absolutely beautiful. Mm -hmm. So if we don't find the one this trip, we're going back to the drawing board. Um, we're not going to be rushed into this at all. We're going to, you know, it's got to feel right. It's got to feel right. You'll know. You know when you know. I was going to say that my mom and my stepdad, they went by this place that we're going to tomorrow. And my mom was like, I need to tell Sydney about this. She didn't know that we were already going to see that one. And she said on the phone with us that there's just like a wow factor to it when you drive up. And that's, that's what I'm excited about. Mm -hmm. So yeah, excited, but I wanted to update you guys. Um, so about to finish up charging here and then we're going to make the final stretch to the hotel, probably grab a little dinner. We talked about possibly working out, but we're not getting in until 9 p.m., so. And that's gonna be like a 9.30 dinner. <laughs> yeah, so we'll see. And been up since 4 a.m., um, so it's been a long day. We just got to our destination, and we found this really cool little like restaurant. It's literally like, a old house it's so cool I know you guys can't really see it but hopefully I'll get some videos um, when we're leaving but yeah it's really cool we're about, we're about to have a, a living room. yeah we're about to have a quick bite to eat and then get to bed yeah. mm -hmm. Yummy. I got white fish We are stuffed. How you feel, babe? I'm so glad that we got some food finally and I'm tired. Tired. Yeah, we're ready to hit the hay. But anyways, this place is called Grey Gables Restaurant and I think you guys can see it, but it's literally like a house. It's the coolest thing. <clears throat> coolest thing. It's pitch black out here, but we're gonna call it a day. We are I headed know. to knock out. Headed to the bed. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Peace. We are up. It is 7.35. Um, we were able to sleep in a little bit, which we needed so much. Sydney and I were talking and we were just saying how good we feel actually sleeping in this morning, but we're up, um, I'm down in the hotel gym. It's extremely small, but I'm about to knock out my run. I'm gonna do two miles on the treadmill. It's like 50 degrees outside. And then I'm going to run up and do a day pass at the gym, um, the fitness center, the local gym. So, and then we have to go and tour that venue at 11.30. Y'all, this is so pretty. It's crazy to think that this is a lake. Um, I keep saying it, but I can't even like believe myself saying it, but yeah, this is a lake. And I think this has kind of solidified the area for me. When we talk wedding venue, this is just like everything that I'm wanting because how nice would it be to have our guests come down and see something like this? I mean, you have so much water to do stuff. I think this is just so nice. So nice. No, like what do you this think? It's just, I feel like this is exactly what we wanted to have by us, wasn't yes, it? Yes, there was. We're excited to see the venue. Welcome to Michigan, baby. <laughs> this is what happens whenever I get busy, I forget to either bring my camera or pick the camera up to show or just update. Um, so, if you guys just missed the gym, you missed the uh, venue and you missed our lunch but <laughs> it all it all was um very good it was very nice sydney and i we absolutely love this place so much that we even stopped and looked at some real estate <laughs> but um yeah it went really good um we absolutely loved the venue uh the people were very very sweet there they were nice we 
think it might be the one, but we're still really just kind of taking it all in and, um, you know, just having multiple conversations about it because we're not really the people that make decisions very quickly, so. Well, I'm working on it. <laughs> she's working on it. She's doing a lot better, but I, I like to process things. I like to sit and, you know, weigh out the pros and cons and really take it all in and think about it for a little bit. And um, yeah, then I, you know, usually come up with my final decision, but this is for both of us. We want to make it very special. We want it to be very special, obviously. And um, the place we saw, it was, it was outstanding. It was so nice. It goes perfect with my last name, her soon to be last name, so. Yeah, but um, now we're in the car, we're headed to the airport. Uh, we've got a bit of a drive, but it was a good little trip. Uh, my first time in Michigan, I love it. So I'm sure I'll catch up with y'all in a little bit when we're looking for a charger. Yeah, right. Super charger. Yeah, stay tuned. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we're on time to everything today. Let's all say a quick little prayer. Oh, I, can I tell a story about how many like God things we've had real quick? Yes. We have had so many like, wow. Okay, so I am pretty good about doing this. Jay's very good about anytime something goes really well or like we have a big achievement in our life or whatever it is, we're just like, he's so good about saying like, thank you, Lord. Like he'll say it out loud for both of us, whatever it is. Lord and like, God. yeah, like think, okay. Like we're not even gonna say, wow, I got so lucky. Wow, what a coincidence. Wow, how wild that that happened. Like what we got so like wow you know what i mean and today we were like really stressed about this stupid charger for the tesla and then we finally were like hey you know it is what it is we'll figure it out let's just walk let's just walk to the gym we walk out literally in the 24 hours that we've been there no one had left a car and then we're walking out and the, the people who were parked in the spot with the tesla were walking out of their car switch spots with us so we were good on that then we get locked out in our uh wedding tour right mm -hmm. and we're out on this like balcony thing and we're thinking oh no this is gonna put us back if we get up here she didn't have her phone on her right right and then she like kind of goes on the door a couple times and we're like oh okay well let's just call it opens not a coincidence We are back in Tampa. Yesterday was very, very busy. A lot of driving, um, flight to catch, a layover. I just didn't have the time to vlog and kind of keep you guys up to date, but um, an overall recap on it, we absolutely love both of the venues, but we're at a place where we kind of want to keep our options open. So we haven't picked a place yet. Um, we're still going to tour, I think, two other states, two or three. And then I think after that, you know, we'll eventually pick a spot. But, um, you know, the wedding planning, it's all here. And, yeah, it's exciting. It's, ex it's very exciting. You know, we absolutely loved the two days of touring both those venues. Loved each of the venues. But we just want to keep going, keep looking. Don't want to settle just yet. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this one off. Um, we're back, we got a lot of catching up to do today. Got my run in, I'm about to knock out uh, a workout and then I've got a bunch of work stuff to do and helping Sydney out. So uh, we'll catch y'all in the next vlog. Bye y'all.